Welcome to the Dusk Theater. You're about to embark on an adventure. Okay, there we go. Strange, wondrous happenings. And at the heart of this adventure, there was a. Oh, didn't I not turn cell titles on? All shall unfold before your eyes. Together, we will see this story to its end. So it begins. Yeah, I did not turn subtitles on. I think that should be automatic, though. Should it not? Hmm. Here we are, the town of Refrain. Oops, I need to lower it. Wow! Look, Madam Junior! Krabbies! Little pinchy Krabbies! Um... Would you like to talk? Yeah, I know that. I, it's just whatever, I guess. That they, uh... Luca, I thought I told you to stay in the caravan. Get back inside now, or I'll turn you into a toad. This is why I hate kids. Oh, I need to uh, fix my mic. <sighs> when you arrive, come to my manor. We have other matters to discuss. <laughs> this small town peasant has some nerve to be giving me instructions. <laughs> Who's this? A visitor? In our... town? <laughs> How rare. <laughs> Why, hello, puppet. <laughs> What's a pretty town like you doing in a girl like this? <laughs> Anyways, could you maybe spare some change? I already... <laughs> With all my booze money for today. Huh? Okay. Got a bum leg, do ya? Oh. Yes. The little new give you there a, we go. That's a little better. Hop on, my lady. <laughs> Newt, was it? I have a sneaking suspicion that you're plenty drunk as it is. Yeah, I'll probably oh, turn down the voices. Should I? You don't seem I don't intelligent know. enough to be our guide. What'd you say? Perhaps you've merely deluded yourself into thinking you're familiar with this town. That's... well... You no, know, I, I know oh, more than you oops, I ever ought to put this on my phone. So, then... Do you know where I might find the well of Kalaza? Yeah, uh -huh. of course. Everyone in Refrain knows about the well. It, it's Oops, where are they? From the town gate, you what? just walk oh, over a hundred and down the hole. So anyways, <laughs> straight I ahead. Guess I didn't cool. need to ask you at all. We're done here. Oh, and for the record, I can't afford to waste my traveling expenses on drunk shepherds. Okay. What? You think you can get lippy with me? Just because you got a pretty face and perky knockers? Mm. Newt, our business here is finished. Now piss off. Why you? <laughs> Suck a bitch! You ain't even that pretty. Hmm? He forgot one of his lambs. 
What a careless shepherd. <laughs> so be it. Hey, Luca! Here I am, Madam Junior. You called for me? Take care of this lamb for me. Take care of it? You mean, like a pet? I get to keep it? Really? Just make sure it behaves and keep it out of the caravan. She named it already. <laughs> that child is usually so indecisive. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Huh? I thought it was over. Is this the place, oh. Madam Junior? Yes. Our destination is the Well of Kalaza, which resides here in the corner of Refrain's town square. The caravan shall serve as our base of operations, and the prison from which we can Yeah, I don't know why. Tedious daily reports. Still kind of just like these games. Now start setting up the caravan campsite and see that you finish Even though they're us. visual okay, right novel s And do not bring that lamb inside the caravan, understood? The only thing I hate more than children is animals. Okay then. What's rain natus? Now, to prepare for the expedition. Luca, fetch me the Tractatus de Monstrum. Huh? But, but what about the governor's letter? Eh? The letter said we had to meet him once we got here, right? Shouldn't we do that? <laughs> My time is far too precious to waste on the likes of him. All he'll do is prattle on and on while saying nothing of actual importance. Now, if you have time to presume what I should be doing, then begin the preparations. Chop, chop, Luca. Is, um, the PC version only support Japanese audio for English text? Um, let's see. Get out of the way. Oh yeah, I know all that. Yeah. Okay, yes, I know all this stupid tutorials. Yeah. Is this the well? This appears to be the well of Kalaza. It's inside this rotunda, to be precise. But, but it's locked. You're not allowed inside. Isn't that what a lock means? It's not much of a lock, really. Are you gonna open it with your magic? Oh, thank you, Lord. Keep your voice down. Yeah. Okay, there. Did you just call me? Is it? Oh no, the volume wasn't turned down. This well is connected to an underground Should have watched this after. That rumor may, in fact, be true. <laughs> Why well, can't I really focus on it? Yeah, I will. It, it looks really old. Our 
Are we going down the well? Is that even safe? For us? No. It's full of miasma down there. That's no place for humans. In fact, no human has ever gotten out alive, with one exception. Luca, fetch the Tractatus de Monstrum. Okie dokie, I'll go get it! Let's go, Baba! Leave the lamb, just bring me the book at once. Ah. Hey, I gotta work right now. I'll feed you later, but you gotta wait right here, okay? Oh, no one whatever. has ever gotten out alive. Well, that's why we have the Tractatus de Monstrum and the puppet soldiers. No. Uh, yeah. Whatever. Oh, what? Shut up. You'll draw attention to us. Hm. No sound of impact. Interesting. This racket over one sheep. Shut up. <laughs> now, did you bring the book? Throw it in. Huh? In the well? No, Madam Junior. We can't do that. Then Tracty will die too. Tracty? Don't give it a nickname. We don't know what'll happen if we throw it in. And. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> you only get a bad feeling when you're about to wet the bed. Ah, that's, that's not true. I don't wet the bed. Just give me the book already. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hello. Monstrum. Go forth and conquer the unexplored underground. Say that after this. Hopefully, this is the end of the. Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, what is it? I bought the sequel. I wasn't going to, but I just said, screw it. Well, I bought the sequel and freaking now I'm probably gonna skip Golden Wink, which obviously is in the end of April or beginning of May, I don't remember. It's like, um, uh, yeah, because I thought, uh, what is it? Octopi Traveler 2 was better than it was. I'm not saying it isn't good. Because all of us see... What is it? I haven't played the second game. So yeah, I have no clue if it is good or not. Um, it's stress that... Yeah, I don't know. It's, um, that you can't decrease the difficulty. It's like on the second playthrough, you could change the difficulty. 
But yeah, that's a second freaking uh, playthrough, and I think um, all of that really does uh, there be harder difficulties, uh, not easier ones, because that wouldn't make sense. At least I don't think so. circle to that um. yeah I like that better um, when you press back, you turn around instead of back, so... Right, Freaking... I changed that, that's so much better. I don't know why would you do that. That seems so annoying. Maybe that's just me. Yeah. Seems extra annoying. Yeah, it's like, what, press, whatever. Sure. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay, there is a load of nothing in there. Because I remember there was another door. It's just I didn't know where it was. seems a little slow I don't know if yeah I don't know what it's at honestly Let the battle begin. 
God damn it. But, um, yeah, I played a little bit. Whoa. Yeah, I tried to play a little bit. I played a little more than a little bit, to be honest. Of the second game, I, uh, fast forward through the, uh, cussing, so I don't know what the hell they're saying. And they, uh, were saying, because I don't wanna, I don't know, guess, spoil myself, but I don't think that's a real spoil. Spoiler. Let's get started. But whatever. See if I can do that. Here I go. Okay, can use the back button. Um... Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I'll play this for two hours or three. Okay. This is the story of a faraway world where faint traces of magic still linger. A world called Tennis. The mysterious town of Refrain resides there. And deep beneath that isolated yeah, that was town weird. lies an unexplored underground. Like, I mean, this is subtitled. But when I started the game, it wasn't. It's like, okay, that makes zero sense. Well, little sense, I should say. that could control the world. Treasures that could make one immortal. And a slumbering demon king whose awakening could end the world. But no one knows for certain. Yeah, I'll take that out and hopefully... No, I moved everything. What is known is that the labyrinth when is filled with cursed uh, miasma. 
your uh, ear buds. Why is it not? Oh, apparently he's a reset this far. One day, a witch arrived at Refrain with the intention of exploring this labyrinth. Um. Her name was Dusk Witch Dronia. She had in her possession a legendary book said to have been written by the only man to explore the labyrinth and survive. She had the Tractatus de Monstrum. Mm. Yeah, I think, um, da, 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 da. welcome, welcome. To well, the I think Titanus. that's also a thing mm. like where peace fire. I mean, oh, Sony's like, uh, hmm. oh, freaking the peace fight's getting to the later half yes. of the Hello? console Hello? cycle. So they're just making excuses oh, why okay. the peace fight nice. didn't sell well. Hey there, you lost soul. But Did yeah, there's all these rumors about a peace five pro and i uh, think anyway, everyone's waiting for that once, all on it, but obviously in just a couple minutes because it's like why buy what a shocking turn of events oh uh, freaking peace <laughs> five when in fact, a peace five pro is going to come out right and we'll be more out. powerful we'll than the PS5. Well, it's not like you really have a choice right now. Chop chop, time's a wasting. Let's get moving. Oh yeah. Maybe that's just me, but yeah, that's probably another reason why people aren't buying the PS5. Cause yeah, something's better is gonna hopefully come out. That's what rumors say. And it's like, who knows if that's true or not. Yeah, you know, it's like what? <sighs> Unfortunately, there are no enemies for you to beat up on here. Um. You're pretty nimble. Okay. And can I know? Do that. Oh, I probably couldn't open the door. If this place sure is mysterious, huh? Too bad I can't tell you where you are. Just a little further. Oh, yeah. I could hold X. Oh, that reminds me. I'm tired of going, uh, if I'm tired of holding forward. 
could hold X. Time for the last step. Just leap into this book. You'll be fine, trust me. Besides, we've got a heart pounding, fantastic adventure ahead of us, filled with romance and courage. So the answer is clear. If you've got a fistful of bravery and two scoops of curiosity, steal yourself and dive in. Okay. Oh, damn. Whoa, I guess we have no freaking other choice. How do you feel? Your soul just went into this book, but this is no ordinary book. Why, this feared, cursed book is known as the Tractatus de Monstrum, and from now on, that's what you are. Beneath the town of Refrain, there is an unexplored underground labyrinth. Yeah, I the think I made the right choice anyway. The only man ever to return from this labyrinth alive. Rumor is was he getting seven days this seven game sequel instead of Octopath Traveler 2. And my facts are, shall we say, unfounded. Because, yeah, I didn't so like I the first game. Died after he finished it. That sort of detail tends to make people skeptical. Now, it's usually a, a sign of a over the you won't like the second game very much. Are you mad? Come on, tell me what you're feeling right now. <laughs> it's understandable, I suppose. Your soul is sealed in that creepy thing. Oh, yes. Could you also tell me your name? You may be the Tractatus de Monstrum, the book that records fate. But your name is still important, even if no one calls you by it. Um, what second? Oh, shoot, I have one bar. Oh, freaking charge my uh, controller. How well my phone? Oh, it's about half. Yeah, I could wait, I guess. But I need to get the charger that ring call um okay now I gotta make sure it's charging yeah it's charging okay cool Can I, uh... Oh, no. Get some bad names, why not? Okay, um, how do I race square? I was just seeing if I could, uh, how much letters I could have. So, oops. Confirm the name. 
Funny you know I'd be able to change your name, proceed. Must be tough to be with such a powerful great witch. Anyway, oh, I can't interfere that much longer. Try to enjoy yourself. Remember, everything you'll need on your journey can be acquired as you go. Now go. I wish you good fortune on your journey. And okay. Never call me a witch while we're in the town. The peasants in this backwater do not take kindly to witches. Then what should I call you? Madam Baba? Hmm. Madam Baba Yaga. No, actually, call me Madam Dronia. Now, let me sleep. It's been a week since we left Craven, and the town should finally be within sight. No! Wait! The book! The book is moving! Huh? Drop it, you little idiot! Stop the caravan! Luca, how many times have I explained the importance of this book to you? Eyes on this book. Why, I should spank your bottom raw for saying something so stupid. Or shall I prepare a special potion? One that will force you to say your true name so I can make you more obedient. Ah, not my name! Not my name! Anything but that! <laughs> Madam Dronia! Madam Dronia! <sighs> Must you cry all the time? on about look see huh. this is see it's got eyes doesn't it i told you so what i didn't feel any mana flowing through that book when we left huh. i can feel a soul what's going on how could this book have a soul and why did I not notice until now? Eyes and a mouth. Hmm. Hey, Tractatus de Monstrum. If you can talk, say something. So you can't actually talk. Hmm. Regardless, it does seem to have a will of its own. At any rate, this book does appear to understand human language. Uh, amazing! This book understands us! Since it's the Tractatus de Monstrum, let's call it Tracti. Yeah, Tracti. Tracti. Can you hear me, Tracti? I'm Luca. Luca. But how is it possible for me not to have noticed this? Every living creature has a soul. And with that soul comes a consistent flow of mana. I'm just speculating, but perhaps this book just spontaneously gained a soul. Hmm, I wonder. Tracti, can you understand what I'm saying? Huh? Can you? <sighs> I'm wasting my time thinking about this. If a soul resides in that book and it can understand us, then we just have to use it to our advantage. <laughs> oh, Tractatus de Monstrum. I'm going to keep you very busy. Luca, if we're to reach the town before nightfall, stop playing with that book and get this caravan moving. We made it, Madam 
Dronia! We're here! We're here! Yeah, I don't know. That's where the well is. Hm. I can't imagine why someone would bother building that rotunda around it. Madam Dronia! I'm gonna set the wheel wedges so the caravan won't move! Now that the brat is gone... All right, Tractatus de Monstrum. If you truly understand my language, then listen carefully. This is our home now, as well as your base of operations as you carry out your mission. Your mission has one objective. Conduct a thorough exploration of the labyrinth beneath Refrain, and conquer it. The labyrinth is filled with toxic miasma that no human can hope to survive. But you are not human, and with you and Luca's puppet soldiers at our disposal, I'm certain we can conquer it. A puppet soldier is an immortal magical being known as a Mananea, created by placing a soul within a puppet. They are lifeless here on the surface, but when exposed to mana, they become animate. And my okay. witch's intuition is telling me that there are rich stores of mana underground. I can tell you have a will of your own. So before I continue, I must ask, will you conquer the labyrinth for me? Um. Oh, you consent. I didn't expect that answer from you, but it's a good answer nonetheless. All that aside, there was no reason for me to ask you that question in the first place. Care to know why? <laughs> because I don't trust you. A book that happens to contain a soul and that book has agreed to explore the labyrinth for me, no questions asked. Impossible. I refuse to believe such rubbish. I only believe in that which I can personally observe and affect. Now, here's something you should know. I can sense the flow of mana within others. By manipulating that flow, I can enthrall souls to carry out my bidding. To a certain extent, that is. You possess a soul and mana, and you also possess a name. That's all I need to exercise my power. <laughs> do you understand what I'm going to do with you? Okay. Tractatus de Monstrum, hear my words. I, Dusk Witch Dronia, command you. Obey me, and use my Witch Brigade to conquer the Labyrinth of Refrain. You cannot break this soul-bound pact. Once your soul has carried out this order, only then will I liberate it from this loathsome world. <laughs> you cannot disobey me now. But you're not completely enthralled either. For the most part, you can act as you please. Whether you lust for destruction or riches, you're free to indulge either desire when you're beneath the ground. Though you have less freedom on the surface, if you require the services of this caravan, speak to Luca. Do you understand? Otherwise, yeah, I, I think carry the next time biking will be days of play. Because... Yeah, I believe they have. Yeah, I believe they have PSN store um, sales going on, and not just the web store. Well, Sony Direct. I know they have uh, sales there for. Uh, PlayStation gear. Oh, uh, what is it though? Oh yeah, I think they would also have, uh... Yeah, freaking sales on PlayStation Store. Mm 
Because obviously, I don't see why they wouldn't. Yeah, I know, I know, honey, yeah, I know. Um. Yeah, I know that. Okay, um, oh, that's how you change appearance. Okay. Is that it? How do you... Oh, no, that's not how you do that. Yeah, how do you change from... Male to female? Oh, it's just... Okay. So the males are on top and the females are on bottom. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't really tell you. Oh. Uh, how do I? Oh. Yeah, berry melon. Okay. In my bill master let's frog raise up oh fog raise up I'm a bell master
Yeah, Twinkle. Yeah, I want to do that. Okay, cool. Peggy. I think I, yeah. to do this first. Yeah, I understand. Why do I probably have to do this though? It's almost dusk. Perfect. At this hour, my powers are at their peak. Are we really gonna do this? The miasma underground might be really, really thick. Hmm? Are you saying the miasma might be Yeah, it's been 54 minutes. Jesus. Well, that's certainly possible. Oh, yeah, I was going to see that. I know. See, I have no to be cautious, I suppose. I thought that was kind of funny, though. Maybe I'm not like strange, but which to stay whatever. Um now you can pass through most of the miasma. It probably wouldn't affect you anyway, but it doesn't hurt to take precautions. Yeah, I don't know. I think the stories in Well the story in this game is more 
Yeah, it's more entertaining than Octopath Traveler 2. Now, Tractatus de Monstrum, go forth and conquer the unexplored underground labyrinth of Refrain. Um, what was that? Oh. Yeah, why was I constantly just freaking hitting the wall? I think I accidentally was hitting R2. Uh. Is there no uh, battle speed? Yeah, there's no battle speed. That kind of sucks. Oh well. Um. I turn. Oh yeah, there's mana spots. Oh, I'm gonna see if it does that. Oh no, it doesn't. Crap. Whatever, I do this. Anyway. Okay. It's like I only came back because I wanted West petitions. Reduce the difficulty. One less mana. Yeah, whatever. I'll do that to make it easier. It's like, um, that's what I wanted. Yeah, to go back and freaking do that. And make it easier, so. I don't know, I just like doing that. Yeah, it's because I I'll forget that. Mm. 
so. Oh, you could change equipment, okay. Oh god, I was set up my um Yeah, my piggy's going up. kind of sucks you can't do that like in um what's that game oh yeah um, like I decided to play that game on uh, off stream though Oh, uh, frickin' uh, Mary Skelter. And just because that game... I don't know. That game is just way too frickin' wordy. But maybe I will play it, I don't think so though. Because I'm already like quite far. It's just like, yeah, like, King could be so much better, but I just, yeah, I don't really focus on that. Because I think if you focus on, like, oh, this game could be, um, yeah, if you focus on what a game could be, Instead of what the game is or whatever, it's like, yeah, I think you'll kind of never be happy with the game. But maybe that's just me. Who knows? I think that's the same uh, for that.
Um, I know I guys, uh, well, there was a video that I, like, I thought that was absolutely stupid, that video. Where it's like, um... What is it? Oh yeah, it was like... How to stop analyzing, uh... Uh, how divers too interested in, and enjoy the game, it's like... Um, just don't do it. Like, that's the simplest advice I could give. <laughs> like, just don't do it. But, like, that's what I just mean, like, that there's some videos that are just completely worthless. Like, I don't mean to be whatever, but it's like, yeah, I guess there will always be games like that. I mean, videos like that on... Freaking YouTube, no matter what, though. Link there was also what another freaking thing. Oh yeah, Sumer said uh, that I thought that was kind of stupid. That he said, uh, what's the point of uh, freaking being good at a game? I know what he meant, but still I was like, at least to myself, I was like, Maybe getting past the game, that's the point of being good, but obviously I knew what he meant, like, because he meant being, what's the point of being great at a game? Because, yeah, it's just, most of the time at least, it just seems that, I don't know, people just have more fun with not taking the game seriously.
Yeah, I think he just said it. Weird, obviously. Yeah, I guess they don't all have healing. Like on the, in the second game, yeah, they all have healing no matter what. Oops. I totally forgot about that. This is why, like, I think the Africa is kind of cool. Kind of annoying. Whatever. Yeah, I don't mean to go further, and I just don't know where the exit is. Oh my god.
Thank you all. She's so hard to kill because she has a uh, skill to uh, freaking heal herself. Oh, come on, ready? Um...
Ähm. Okay, so even if they're knocked out, they get. Okay, I understand. Um. Blocks. Quarry. Oh, million pie, sure, why not? Million pie. No, let's just say melon. Um. Oh, is that, does that mean uh, I have another? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um... Yeah, I'm trying to look for any passages I missed. No, this is the only passage I missed. Well, there's a bunch of mana. Like, yeah, there's a bunch of mana. So, I don't know. So, A4, okay. Um, shoot. There might be more items to find. Yeah, since I'm not done, what am I not done with? Oh, 
I see it. Oops, not map, not item. Okay, for camp. Um, oh, I don't have that, so what is this? Obtain unfamiliar to fire. Oh, that's what it was. I didn't. Oh, I should have engaged. I think that's the same thing, <laughs> but whatever. to do that. <laughs> um Battle start. Give him what for. I keep doing that. Like 
I don't know if that does anything actually though. Oh, that's so dumb. It was on the other side of the wall. So, I don't know. Like it says triangle, okay. But you could do the same thing with axe though. So it's like I don't understand. But I guess whatever. Is that all? Oh, I thought I, um, someone else level up. It's not. And it's like. What is that? Oh yeah, freaking they said uh, that. Oh, uh, what is it? Oh yeah, two best friends. Uh, he said like, oh uh... Yeah, I don't always play the games that you only like. Obviously play um in other games too. Uh, too obviously I uh, well, he didn't see that, but more or less to, like, grow, and it's like, okay, I understand that, like, no duh. Like, have appealing content rather than just only one type of content. It's like, yeah, I understand that, but it's like, yeah, that's just such a risk do that well at least when you're like small like when you have a small YouTube channel it's like yeah it's just dumb to freaking like 
invest all of your money into the freaking channel. Because, okay, let's say you uh, invest all your money into a channel and you don't get it and you don't really see any of that, like, investment uh, back to you, sort of thing. And it's like, oh, cool, you're out however much money. It's just so dumb. I know, um... Like, um... People who do our work, I know they, uh... Want you to just spend your money, like wildly sort of thing because it's like yeah obviously because you're paying them so obviously they want that but I just see that as gullible to be perfectly honest. Yeah, I don't know, maybe that's me, but yeah, I would think that's just people being gullible. Uh, like a person just, uh, Telling a kid to press like what is it F four on uh on their computer. I don't exactly know what it does. I think it just exits uh the game honestly. But I could be wrong, I don't know. <laughs> I keep forgetting that's fucking there. <laughs> I don't know how I keep forgetting that, but I keep forgetting it.
Yeah, that sucks. We're a member, don't go that way. Yeah, I don't know. Jesus, I was almost going to do it again. Time has passed. Give me the book. Hmm. Which report is written on a blackened page? I see. While the Tractatus de Monstrum is exploring, its findings are recorded on a blackened page. Good to know. Your progress thus far is impressive, but these findings suggest that the flow of time is different down there. I don't know what to make of this. Still, it would seem the Labyrinth's reputation is not entirely unearned. And this Tractatus de Monstrum appears to be the genuine article. Good job, Tracti! Looks like you're the real deal! So these are some of the treasures the Labyrinth contains. These items could not possibly be products of this world. You can tell by looking at them? They look normal to me. How can you tell? If you could see the flow of mana as I can, you'd see that these items are practically overflowing with mana. Wow! Ah, yes. Tracti, I shall open your eyes so that you too may see the magical power these items possess. You will be able to discern the rarity of certain items. Bring any rare items you find to me. Then again, if you had such items when I reviewed your findings, I would have taken them by now. Your will is my will, Tracti, and I assure you, I will put you to work. <laughs> Madam Junior, you called him Tracti. That's my name for him. I came up with it all by myself. Shut up. If you encounter any difficulties during your exploration, report to me and I will repair you as necessary. Open 
open the door. Yes? Who is it? Please forgive my sudden intrusion. Is this where I might find Great Witch Baba Yaga? Oh? Oh. <clears throat> Indeed, you stand before Great Witch Baba Yaga. Mm -hmm. And you are? My name is Klaus Carter. I serve the governor of this town. My master has sent me to escort you to his residence, ma'am. His master? Oh, the man who wrote the letter. Damn it. Still, I can't exactly refuse him. I apologize for not visiting sooner. I did not know where your master resides. May I ask you to escort me? Certainly, ma'am. That is why I am here. Please, come with me. Something the matter? You said your master is the governor of this town, but is your master also a business owner? Yes, but his shops are in remote parts of town. For this reason, my master's wealth is actually quite modest. Oh, I should not say such things to a guest. This, in fact, is my master's finest shop. I do hope you'll shop here during your stay. What a big shop, Madame Dronia! Huge even! It's got a bunch of bunch of stuff for sale! <sighs> my master is just ahead, in his study. This way, please. Please wait here. I shall summon the acting governor right away. Acting governor? Yes. Oh, did I neglect to mention that earlier? To my knowledge, this town has never had an official governor. The acting governor is the master of this town. Oh, ah, Klaus, you've so returned. Weird. Have you brought Madam Baba Yaga? Oh, oh. <laughs> Yes, Master Patrone. Great Witch Baba Yaga stands before you. W why? <laughs> I was not expecting her to be so beautiful. Thank you for summoning me. I am Baba Yaga, and this is my apprentice, Luca. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. Y yes, like she said, I'm L Luca. I I'm Madame Baba Yaga. As a princess. I read your letter and I believe I understand the broad strokes of your request. Explore the mysterious labyrinth and bring back rare magical items. That is what you want, yes? P -p Precisely. As a great witch, is it within your power to grant that request? But of course. Why else would I make the perilous trek across the western mountains? Wonderful. <laughs> But, I must say, I never expected a famous great witch to be so young and beautiful. I was told you were a powerful witch, so I had imagined you to be an old crone. Forgive my impertinence, but are you really Baba Yaga? Master Patrone, that is a rude question. Powerful witches can use magic to look as young as they please. <laughs> I understand your reservations, but I assure you, I am the real Baba Yaga. Once I deliver the results of my exploration, that should ease any doubts you may have. However, I would prefer that you address me by my alias, Dronia. People would panic if they learned a witch was among them. My true identity must be kept secret. Perhaps you're right. Anti-witch bigotry still runs deep here. Now then, have you seen the Well of Kalaza? Yes. In fact, I sent an underling down there earlier to assess the situation. I see. The people know to avoid that place. It would be problematic if someone saw you. 568 people are recorded as having died exploring the labyrinth. That count may actually be 10 times higher. Those who have returned alive number fewer than 10. 
That's because they ran away. And those cowards would just ramble on about onions fishing for dead flesh or some giant woman in a swamp. <sighs> That's not to concern is ourselves with you talking the about uh the only man to I forget her name, Natalia. You speak of the Tractatus de Monstrum. So, you know. Uh, do, do you happen to have the Tractatus yeah, de Monstrum? Yeah, I'll probably replay that game too. Unfortunately, no. However, I'm certain that it can be found uh, in the labyrinth. The Hydrid Witch. You just let Yaga worry about that. Ah, yes. I mean, the Hydrid Light and the Witch or whatever it's called. I honestly forget what it's called. I do not know if this has any monetary value, but nonetheless, I hope you will accept this gift. Oh, you already found something. I knew I made the right choice in seeking your aid, great witch. It's like I don't know. Obviously, this yeah, is in the, the Disgaea, uh, the Disgaea art style, and I don't know. I think that art style, will, like, is really, really good. Do you own and operate those businesses as well? And the story is a plus, having a great story and having great gameplay is also another plus. Like it kind of sucks that Square Enix doesn't, yeah I can't really do the same but whatever. I've never heard of that currency before. What? Oh, 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 of course you haven't. This is a... Yeah, the witch and hide knight. Then, how much can I get in exchange for 300 Halt's Kingdom gold coins? Halt's Kingdom gold coins? I've never heard of that currency. Let me see. Hmm. This gold appears to be high gold. Yeah, I'll probably play this game. Then the Western Hydrant Knight. And also, hopefully, finish Resistance. And, um. Obviously, chip away at everything else. Then will you allow me to open a theater in town? I would do so at my caravan near the well. I can confirm that Baba Yaga, I mean Madame Dronya, has in fact parked her caravan there. My, I, I cannot let that stand. Approaching the well is forbidden. I shall have it removed at once. <laughs> Pardon me, uh, Klaus. May I have a glass of water? My throat is parched from my long journey. Because I really think I will. And I beat a few games. Like how many games? I don't know how many until June. Governor Patrone, will you allow me to open yeah, a I'll be in town? Probably will be so two or three games by the then. If they're even shorter, I'll 
all to see me of more. Of course, you cannot live among us as a witch. Your cover story will be that you are a traveling performer. It's just that's a problem. Well. It's like the game I play are so goddamn wrong. Well. I will fulfill your request. Like isn't in this like the 40 hours or something? Would be prudent if I could I mean, actually don't taxes. know. Your shop will purchase anything I find in the labyrinth, regardless of market value. And so labyrinth of refrain. Well. Now, as far as exchanging currency is concerned, does 10,000 CL silver coins sound fair to you? Well, <clears throat> though I have every intention of supporting your expedition, that amount seems... Deal. Uh, Kogan, my shop will buy the items you find underground, and Oops. you will receive ten thousand silver coins. Up oh front. God! Thank you. You are a tough but fair negotiator. Also, also, I will pay a high price for any amazing magic items you find. I understand. Though this arrangement is but temporary, I look forward to doing business with you. Uh -huh. Madam Dronya, your water. Yeah, how long? Oh, it's and a 55 hours. Jesus. Oh, right. Forgive me, Madam Dronya. When focusing on the like main very much objective, Labyrinth of Refrain, about 50 hours. I, have yet to explain to you. I don't know why it says that, dinner. though. Come, if you're a gamer that starts to see all aspects of the game, it's likely to spend around 110 hours. It's like, I don't know why they say that. Then I will come for you tomorrow to stable your horse and finalize the currency exchange. Like, hmm. but if you're a gamer, you'll spend longer. It's like, uh, if you play games, period, you're a gamer. What do you mean? When the evening bell rings three times, lock your doors and do not open them until morning. Duly noted. Good night. Let's go, Luca. Y yes, ma'am. Good good night, Mister. It's like, I don't mean to be whatever, but it's just so dumb. Find more items. Okay. Whatever. 
kind of have to well proceed uh, this way because there's no other way to go So like I want to play that game too, but um, I want that game to go down price, like probably twenty dollars I get it, because I don't think it will go to any lower, honestly. Um, uh, what is it? Oh, Dean Gay's Extra, which is just a remake of the first game. Because, um, yeah, that was a PlayStation Vita game, and it's like, yeah, I don't know. It's like, that game, yeah, it was good, but that was a PlayStation Vita game, and it's like, that came out how many years ago? That was it. Yeah, isn't um the sequel about the same length? Maybe only like. 50 hours instead of 55 but yeah that's still 
really good. Um... So, oops, uh, it's there, oh yeah, there it is. Okay. Like, no shit, do I understand? Like as soon as I said that, I figured that out. Like you could just start the battle and they will, uh, like all use basic attack. <laughs> like goddamn. Oh. 
Oh, I got a shield. Is there or no? Oh, um, how do I do that? Is this sealed? Oh, freaking. Is the clothes better? No. Yeah, that's all. That, um, yeah, the clothes didn't really do that as much. Seriously. Freaking are the enemies just getting weaker? Oh, I got a better sword. So if I do this, it brings up attack, but it minus critical raise and blocking chance. Oh, I gotta get a better sword though. Because, like, is it actually worth it?
Um, hmm. Oh. Uh, how do I get over there, though? Um... Why is she doing that? Um, where am I? Um, yeah. Oops. Uh, um, 
so there we go now I was really I don't know, it's like maybe he can like ignore that call because I don't know, I think it may be important but it's like yeah, I have my door shut so it's like whatever I think um I don't know, I could hear this first, I don't think the mic can. Um, what is that? Okay, we go there. Oh, how do we... Oh, that's... Hmm... Okay, if we go with... All the way back, I guess. Whatever. So, um, um, now. Okay, yeah, then we go there. Is there, is that a chest? Might as well look. Oh, it's a chest I already freaking looted. Okay. Never mind. Yeah, it's like, I guess sometimes, obviously, I forget about that. <laughs> um, that pressing down would, uh, make you instantly turn around. Okay, I got another parrot. That's cool. Um, how do we, is that just a, whatever, yeah, I think it is. So, uh, how long is that? Oh, I guess I will go, um, what is that, 20, um, yeah, 20 some minutes, um, 20, Yeah, 23, I think that is. I'm bad at math. God damn. Um, yeah, she has a sword. Um, wait, I thought I... Oh no, I picked up a scythe, not a sword. Oh, she's, uh, somewhat good with, uh, frickin' nice size. Uh, what about a hammer? Okay, 
He's not that good with a hammer, but this is better for some reason. I don't get that. Um, I'll turn this switch. I think a GA could go through there now. Oh no, I can't do that yet. There's still exploring I have to do. Um, so, why didn't you, whatever. I think I already said that, but yeah, Colin crazy that I like this game over uh, Octopath Traveler 2 because the first game wasn't that great. Doubt the second game will be. But, um,. I did that with, um, uh, what is it, Last of Us 2, like I didn't like the first one very much, but the second game, like, was, yeah, like, the second game was, like, so much better. So, yeah, I don't know. It's just... Whatever, I guess. So, go there and we do this. I kind of want to see the magic pack. Like if that adds um freaking more than one freaking thing. Oh, um, Incoming. Victory. yeah, what Goddamn freaking.
can move, I can fight. <sighs> Gotta get back to work. Ugh, the dinner's finally over. I swear, I must have caught that oath leering at my chest 36 times. 36! Can you believe that idiot, Luca? He wanted to give 1,000 silver coins in exchange for 300 gold coins. Did he really expect me to believe his peasant money is worth thrice that of the Halt's kingdom? The nerve! In most cities, that amount of gold would get you 4,000 silver coins at the bare minimum. Really, it's his own damn fault I had to glamour him. I'll give him as much gold as he wants, but I'm not forking over all my money while I'm stuck in this backwater. Still, it's a little peculiar for this town not to have a local bank. Luca, give me a silver coin. Where's Luca? I'm honored that you enjoyed it. Uh, huh? Madame Dronia! Did she go to the bathroom? Madame Dronia left some time ago. Oh, there's that awful bell. Better head back. Madame Junior! Madame Junior! Oh my, what's the matter? Huh? It's dangerous for a little girl to be out by herself. Where is your home? I'll take you there. No, no, no! Auntie Dronia's gone, and I'm trying to find her! Separated from a family member? Are you lost? At this hour, a lost child is... No, no, no! That's not it! I'm not lost! Auntie Dronia is! Are you an outsider, by chance? Ah, then you must not know your way around this town. I'll help you look for your auntie. R really You will? Auntie Tronia gets lost easily, every time I look away. I'm sure we can find her. This town isn't that big. What the? How peculiar. I could have sworn I was on the right path to the caravan, but... I've never been here before. Ah! I see now. Yes, yes, if you make a left here, you exit out to the square. <laughs> now I understand the layout of this bizarre town. The town planners were total imbeciles. <laughs> Just follow the flow of mana. B back here again? N no, this can't be right. If I didn't know any better, I'd swear this whole town is one big labyrinth. Damn it. First the governor tries to rip me off, then I lose Luca, and now I don't know where the hell I am. I can't.
can't believe Luca went back without me. She has failed me as an apprentice. Uh, Madame Dronia's mad. She's really, really mad. Uh, I feel like the square is this way. Yeah, it has to be. Woo! Are you hurt? Y yes, I'm fine. It seems you've caught me under less than flattering circumstances. Please give me your hand, Madame Dronia. We can't have any dirt sullying that beautiful face of yours. No, I'm okay. I can stand on my own. M Madame Dronia? Luca, remind me to discipline you when we return to the caravan. Oh, I haven't even introduced myself. How rude of me. My name is Marietta. I live at the Abbey. <laughs> I asked her all by myself to help me find you, Auntie Dronia. Don't call me your aunt. I'm not even old enough to be your aunt. Please, I insist you come with me. The Abbey is not far from here. You can stay with me tonight. No, we already have a place to stay. You're new to this town, yes? There the we go. Dangerous at night. Done with come along, Luca, my child. God damn. Wait. I don't know why sometimes he gets stuck, but okay, whatever. Just stay until sunrise. We must hurry. Hey, wait! I didn't even say I'd... So, what am I doing here again? I brought you something to eat. It's not much, but please help yourself. Wow! Can you believe it, Madame Dronia? Warm soup! Let's eat! Oh. <sighs> well, I suppose it's a sin to waste food. Whoa, well, because it's like I apologize yeah. for the bad food. This copyright nonsense I don't want to potatoes. deal with. It's fine. She loves potatoes. Oh, that's good to hear. Huh? Someone's at the door. Is it a visitor? Oh, please. You don't need to worry about that. Oh, yeah, I forgot to do that. I cannot answer the door. Not for the unclean ones. A labyrinth of Galera yes, or something. It may sound hard to believe, but when dusk falls, that's when they appear. That's why when the evening bell rings, people shut their doors and stay inside. Are they g ghosts? I don't know. No one knows, really. If they catch you, they take you to the land of the dead, and they can control you just by looking at you. God forgive me. There are even some who say the unclean ones are demons. So this is just a story people made up to scare children, right? No. The unclean ones really do exist. We've lost many people during the night. We are not a wealthy town by any means. Yet you haven't seen a single homeless person on our streets, have you? Didn't they all get taken away? 
God damn it, no, I don't want to do that. They won't enter homes. As long as you stay indoors at night, you'll be safe. Follow your inner refrain. Do not go out after the evening bell rings three times. <sighs> What's this? A fresh new bed! Look, Madam Joni! Oh, it's these a are bed. really, um. This way, Madam Dronia. Look at it. Whatever, no. I have to sleep in my own room? Can't I sleep with Madam Joni? <laughs> now I don't have to wake up to wet sheets. I, I, I don't want the bed! I don't! My apologies. Because one person said it's 76 hours, the main story of the second game. It's like, I doubt that. But, let's just say it is. It's like, damn. Madame Dronia, are you still alive? Yeah, I said that for, yes. um, is what is it? I opened a new bottle of wine. I was uh, like a dragon. Going to bed. I don't particularly enjoy alcohol. We're longer like games. Oh, that's too Yeah, bad. it doesn't mean it's actually better, it's just... Yeah, it depends on the game. But I think uh, the sequel will be better, even though it's apparently longer. Then let's just pretend to drink it instead. Like, I don't know, just because, like, everything about it is great. Why are you sitting so close like, to me? Like, the art, yes, the story, most likely. Look. And the gameplay is like, mind, I'm just going to leave the room. so yeah, I Excuse won't me. mind it that much. It will probably get a little bit boring at the end, but whatever. But with Like a Dragon 8 or whatever, it's like, yeah, it's like the... Uh, it's like whatever it looks good like the story i don't know the f uh itchy bond is not really a great character he's kind of boring and the gameplay is just kind of boring what do you think you're so it's like yeah no Huh? That's... As you've no doubt guessed by now, my grandmother was a witch. A country witch, in fact. She made her living selling tinctures and tonics for medicinal use. <sighs> a witch, huh? That explains a lot. Very interesting. In that case... Marietta, what are you hiding? I want to know all your secrets. Show me everything. <laughs> Those secrets belong to the Abbey. They are not mine to share. Are you always so domineering, Madame Dronia? I must admit, I rather like this forceful side of you. that and your porcelain skin is so fresh your veins are like a rose garden did you pretend to drink that whole bottle or something that's enough jokes out for you enough oh i'm just getting started the child should be asleep by now you told me to show you everything and so i shall i'll even show you my 
potatoes. Put up a call to find Madame Dronia, but a firm touch is all it takes to thaw your icy demeanor. Isn't that right? H hey! Uh, uh. You'd better stop touching me. Uh, are you all right? You should have told me you weren't feeling well. I understand. Let's stop for now. There's no need to rush things. You can rest in the next room. I'll clean this up. I don't want you to dislike me. And besides, I'm used to waiting. I dislike you? I hate you right now. Good night, Madame Duranya. Sweet dreams. Hear ye, hear ye! Announcing the latest death notice! Three deaths to report. Jill Moritz of West 21st Street. Renee Toto of North 3rd Street. Dal Nestor of 6th Street. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, who the hell's shouting at this hour? Good morning, Marietta. That bed was so comfy. The comfiest I've ever slept in. <laughs> I'm pleased to hear that. Oh, Madame Dronia! Good morning. Good morning, Madame Dronia. I apologize for the firm bed. Are you able to get some rest? You are in a bad mood this morning. Was the bed too firm? Or perhaps... Just shut up. I can't believe a hussy like you is a nun. That guy with the trumpet woke me up. Who is he? Oh, that's the death crier. Every morning, he announces the names of those who died during the night. He tells the whole town whenever someone dies? That's right. It's a custom we adopted then. The new governor took office. What an annoying custom. Thanks for taking us in. Luca, we're leaving. Huh? You can't leave yet. At least eat breakfast before you go. No thanks. Let's go home, Luca. I don't want you going near this woman ever again. Understood? What? But Marietta is so nice. And we should eat breakfast. She made us tatoes, my favorite. If you stay and eat breakfast, I will leave you here. Wh what B -b -b potatoes You're welcome to visit me whenever you like, Luca. I'll make sure to have potatoes waiting for you. Uh, wait! Wait for me, Madame Dronia! There it is, Madame Dronia! Our caravan! Our base! Our home! I'm so happy! <laughs> Huh? What's this? Okay. What is it? A letter? From who? Hmm. Let's see. Stay out of the labyrinth or I will leave you blind, crippled, and writhing in agony. Huh. Is this a threat? I swear, whoever wrote this is an amateur. They didn't even pin it to a horse's head. Huh? Who wrote it? 
I don't know. Do you really think the person who wrote this would also sign the bottom? But let's see. Oh. This letter contains a lot of residual magic. Well, this is an interesting turn of events. W what happened? Do you know what it is? <laughs> it doesn't matter. I figured something like this would happen to liven things up around here. <laughs> Uh, what time was it? Should I? Yeah, it's two fifty-eight. So yeah, I'll stop. I'll probably play this. Uh, wait. Yeah, because I. Um, what is that? Oh yeah, I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. That I obviously will go to. So I don't know if I'll play tomorrow. I may not. Because it's 10. And yeah, that's just going to be horrible. At 10.30. And then I, when I get home, I go back to sleep, and then that, and yeah, I don't think I will want to, I can do that, at all. Um, how do I save? No, I, I don't even know how to save. Yeah, I don't know how I save, so I'll just suspend my uh, play session. I'll go here. And then... Yeah, I saw like that. And I go suspend. That's right. Yeah, it's like, I don't know. Like, can you save in this game? I would think you can, but I don't know how to. But anyways, I'll freaking end there. Um, I'll just uh, press the share button and end. But before I do, I would say... Thanks for all you watching all of this stuff and goodbye. And, um, yeah, I guess I won't play tomorrow because obviously I'll probably, yeah, I get back from the doctors and just want to sleep. And right now it's like, I don't know, I don't feel like going. 
terribly long today. I don't know why don't, but oh well. But anyways, I will press the share button and stop. Uh, stop. Yes.